There were also 83 new cases of COVID-19. The number of active cases statewide stands at 2,251. On the Big Island, the outbreak at the Life Care Center of Hilo has worsened. Eight more residents tested positive yesterday, bringing the total number of residents sickened to 31. That includes two residents who died over the weekend, among those being treated for the virus. Grammy Award winner Kalani Pea's grandmother. This sweet moment of Grammy winner Kalani Pea singing to the woman that inspired him to pursue music and Mama, is the only thing comforting Pea right now. She's truly the love of my life. Lou Kahunani Cristobal contracted COVID at Life Care Center of Hilo, one of the nursing homes on the Big Island battling an outbreak of cases. Like many in similar positions, Pea feels helpless. This pandemic affects all of us in various ways where I live on Maui with my family and my grandmother's in Hilo where we cannot even, we can't even vis visit that facility and hug her and love her and tell her it's okay that you have 104 temperature uh, and you, you have COVID. He settles for video chats with grandmother, but even that is painful. She's at her final stages with Alzheimer's. We're literally talking to someone who just sits there like a doll. And that breaks my heart because we don't know what she's thinking. But she's 90 years old. No one is sitting next to her to love her, to feed her, other than the social workers. Pea's pain mirrors millions around the world. Johns Hopkins University counts over 35 million cases of COVID-19. Over 210,000 people in the U.S. have died from the virus. But now we have to think, of what do we do now? How do we? Ensure that time is so important, whether it's an FB message, an Instagram message, a text, or a call. Find a solution to reach the people you love because you just never know what happens. The Life Care Center of Hilo is upping its cleaning procedures and working with the state health department. It's also testing all staff and residents twice a week.